Hi, it's Kathy here. Um, I'm going to try and show you the different ways to add text links to your WordPress site or any of your website's text. This is, happens to be in WordPress. Um, the first way I'm going to show you is the absolute easiest way. If you have your product already, um, then what we would do is get your text written. Then you would highlight the word or words that you want to link to Amazon. Go up here and click on this little chain link. It says insert edit link. And when you do, it'll come up with this screen. And you would go over to Amazon. And I had picked out a WordPress book. If it would just, this part would go away. Thank you. Okay. Up here at the top, you have the link to this page. I would go in there. I would grab the text only link. And I'd make this bigger so you can see. For this um, application of inserting the text link, you would not use the AHREF because WordPress will do it automatically for you. You just copy the uh, code that is in between the quotation marks. So I'm going to start here where it says HTTP and I go all the way to the end to the other quotation mark. Then I'm going to hit control copy on my keyboard, go back over to my <clears throat> WordPress, highlight the HTTP so it overwrites it and you don't get it twice. And I always click this insert uh, open link in new window when it's leaving my site. Um, then you just click add link and your link is added. That was the easiest way to add a text link in WordPress. If you decide you don't want that link there, you highlight the word again and you remove the link. I'm not going to right now. Just, well, I guess I could, but okay. Next up is if you want to do the text link from the site stripe. Um, basically, we would go into the text editor, go back over here, and you would copy the ahref all the way to the slash a in the brackets, and you would hit control c and copy that. Go back over, and as long as you're in the text editor, we can put it right there. And when you look at the visual, there's your text link. If you wanted to do the text and image link like they show you on Amazon when you first pull it up, you could copy the whole thing. Control copy. And you would put that in there. And while I'm at it, I'm just going to do the image only. That's image only. And <clears throat> for this one, you don't have to copy the whole thing. You can if you want to. But again, just go to the slash A in the brackets. Control copy. And we're going to post that one down there. And we're going to go back to the visual. This here is the text and image, the iframe. That only shows up when you go into preview mode from WordPress to a live preview. And here is the image only link. If I'm going to go off my screen here a little bit, click preview. And we have our text link. We have the text link edited in the text editor. We have the text and image from Amazon, and we have the image only from Amazon. On the image only from Amazon, you can also choose whether to use a small image, a medium image, or a large image. They finally added um, different sizes to what you can do there. Also want to point out, that if you do have an image that's not quite large enough 
for <clears throat> what you want. If you look in, let me see where the image source is. Okay, the image source. See this SL250 right here? If I change that, well, let me actually copy and paste it into my WordPress. Under the text editor. If you go into where it says SL250, and let me show you what, how big it is with the 250 first. See, that's the 250. I say I wanted it really big, like 400. If I go back into the text, I can change that SL250 to 400. And when you go back to the visual, see how much bigger it is. Just a little tip that many people may not or may not know. So rather than have this puny little picture, you can have it almost any size you want. If you get too big, it does distort the picture and it gets fuzzy. But if you need a more prominent image to go with your text, you can change the size in many of them. Not all of them are set up that way. Okay, I think that covers it. If you have any questions, just ask me. Thanks a lot. Bye.